Hello ladies and gentlemen, Holotide here, and the internet is ablaze right now with a rumor about Halo, the Master Chief Collection, coming to PlayStation. It all started with a Reddit thread, which turned into a tweet on Twitter, or X, saying rumored multiple Xbox IPs are coming to PlayStation 5, Sea of Thieves, Hi-Fi Rush, Microsoft Flight Simulator Grounded, Halo, the Master Chief Collection, multiple Bethesda titles are now shifting to a multi-platform release. With Jez Corden, who is a very well-known industry insider, tweeting, you'll see Halo on PlayStation eventually, I reckon. And honestly, I don't really know what to make of this. There's been a ton of Halo stuff, rumors happening. In fact, there was a new Halo Infinite concept art that was on Certain Affinity's website, and everybody was saying that that was Tatanka. They eventually took that picture down, so I have no idea what to make of that. Other than that, maybe people were getting way too excited and they didn't want to, I guess, give false hope. Now, there are no real sources provided about the Master Chief Collection coming to PlayStation. I think that this is kind of coming off the narrative, you know, recently where people were saying that Xbox and Microsoft are going to make more of their titles cross-platform instead of having just first-party console exclusives. Now, in the grand scheme of things, I don't know what the numbers are anymore when it comes to having those exclusives between different consoles because, you know, if you might have an Xbox, you might have a PlayStation, but a lot of people have a console and a PC, so they're able to play these games in different environments like Halo is supposed to be, you know, an Xbox you know, first party exclusive, but it's also on PC. And I don't think that titles necessarily make or break sales for consoles anymore. You know, back in the day with like PlayStation 2 and Xbox 360 and, you know, PS3s and stuff like that, I do feel like there was a bit more of a reason to have these console exclusives. You wanted to sell more of your units of your consoles to, you know, make more money. But now with how games have switched to this games as a service and live service avenues i feel like in order to make the most money you need to have your titles on all platforms especially if it's a free-to-play title so i don't think that this would be the worst thing in the world for microsoft xbox to do is to put halo on all platforms it is the master chief collection it doesn't say anything about halo infinite but i think that that would be good i think that the master chief collection should be the first type of foray into having a cross-platform halo title because it's all of the old titles Allegedly, this is also coming with like Starfield coming to PlayStation and all that other stuff. So honestly, who knows? I do think that there's going to be a lot of announcements this year about Microsoft and Xbox's vision for the future when it comes to games. I do wonder if we're going to see, you know, a console from Microsoft in the future at this point, because it's just like they're buying all these developers and studios you just charge Sony, you know, a ton of money to make them cross-platform or to be only PC exclusive. I don't know. Now, again, take this on with a grain of salt. Personally, I do think that it's literally a 50-50 chance. I think that it would definitely give the franchise some exposure, some goodwill towards the next Halo game because we know that they're working on multiple projects. Inviting a ecosystem that has never gotten to play Halo titles is probably a good thing. And then I can also see it just being completely untrue. Don't fall for any of these, you know, Twitter, Reddit threads and stuff like that. Make sure you do your own research. A lot of people just run with this stuff. And with how Twitter is now, you just make anything up and tweet it. And people are just trying to get money, you know, because you can get paid on there now for impressions and engagement and all that stuff. So people just lie. It's the internet. That's, that's pretty much what it's come down to. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. And I'll catch you around the ring. Peace.